Hey guys, uh, I'm here again one more time and tonight I have a little project that I try to record everything in real time. Uh, a few days ago I got on eBay uh, used Apple 2C Plus uh, in cheap price, I can consider that. And uh, the vendors, the guy that sold me said that the computer was, wasn't working at all. So I just bought it for parts or whatever. When I got the computer here, I plug it in and I saw they have like just a chess table on the screen. No video, like no characters, no nothing, only the chess table. That means something on memory or something else what's happening. So when I got the computer, I opened up, I figured out that the computer has no microprocessor on it. The 65CO02 was gone. So I did, did a little research and I figured out that uh, Apple uses like a different 65C02 on it that uh, I don't know why Apple always screw somehow and I could not find the original one to buy. So I did some research and a uh, few in some forums people using a newer models like uh, the, the one that I got on here that is a W65C02S6TPG-14 that is like a rated, rated like a 14 megahertz processor but I don't gonna be doing any uh, upgrades for speed or nothing I just wanna see if the processor will be working or not so to do that uh, they have to do a little modifications on some pins of the processor to work on the Apple 2 Plus, C Plus. So let's start it, okay? Bring it down the camera. And that's the computer, okay? I just took the screws in the bottom already. So let's just open up. And as you guys can see here, the microprocessor is gone. So before I do anything, let me just get the microprocessor as is and just try to plug it in and see if it works. Probably will not, but let's just do a little testing and see if it works or not. So get the AV cable on here. Power cable. And not, it's still the same thing. Just the chess uh, table on the screen. So, uh, just get the processor out, do a little modification that I saw in some forums and just see what's going on. So, here I got a socket for the processor that we are going to be doing that little modification instead to solder straight the things on the processor and to do that uh, what I'm gonna do will be soldering a resistor that goes for the pin 8 the VDD to the pin 36 that's the BE function on the microprocessor and I'm gonna be cutting out the pin one of the processor, okay? So, uh, on here, first of all, I just gonna do is getting a 3.3K resistor and just jumping from pin 36, that will be one, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, Five, that will be that pin on here to the pin 8 that is the VDD should be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 
eight. So right here, it will be my points of modifications. So let's do like that. So that's the little modification that needs to be done. Just to make sure that I did it right, let's just set one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, and one, two, three, four, five. Yep. So, and right now, the next thing to do it will be to cut it out the pin one of the microprocessor. They will not be going on the circuit anymore. So, Cutting out the pin one. I don't know if you guys can really see it on um, here, what I did here. Yeah, but uh, if you guys want it, I can later on post some pictures and something else for you. And now let me just get the microprocessor on the socket. Here we go. And now just insert the microprocessor on here. And fire up to see if it works. And bingo! Ha! Let me just grab a flop disk I have somewhere here, and I'll be back in a few seconds. I think those here that's something on it. Let me just take a look on here and see if it does. And I got a weird 
screen here that says GSOS requires Apple 2GS hardware. So means that that processor needs to something else needs to be done or upgraded. Let's just try again one more thing here. Well, doesn't work very well. Uh, as you guys can see on here, I can show you right now. See, that's the message that I'm getting. The Pro DOS 16 requires Apple 2GS hardware. There's something else on the microprocessor that needs to be done. I'll take a look and I'll post something else for you guys later on. But so far at least the computer boots up. Because before they was even booting up at all or doing anything. Let's just get one more try. At least Prince of Persia runs. Cool. Uh, just the Pro DOS. I don't know what's happening. If there's any protection or whatever. But as we can see on here, let me just get again another CD here just to show you guys the message that I'm getting to. See? GSOS requires Apple 2GS hardware. Okay, so let's get back the camera back on here. And uh, I will do some other research on it. And I keep you guys posted to see what's going on. Okay, guys. To the next one. And see you soon.